All right, we are picking a champion. Do we want Silas because they have Alistair and Nar? Yeah, why not? Why not? It's been a while since I played Silas. Let's see what they pick. Then we make our runes. Rise. Bit of a tougher one. Is it Conquer? I think it's just Conquer here, yeah. Conquer with what though? Hmm. Resolve? I guess it's gonna be Resolve. <clears throat> I mean, our comp has a lot of ways to make plays. So does there. So does there though. Tear. Tear, 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 tear. So Rice went a little bit more scaling. I'm going a little bit more scaling too with Darkson. So Rice, Salas matchup is kind of bad for Salas because Rice will naturally scale as well and he has very good consistent damage against Salas. And his ultimate is not very good to steal. But I have some good tools here with Narn Alistair. I'm mainly looking to just play slowly, I think, this game and make plays with Lee Sin and Loona. Because I think by myself, I will probably not be able to do much this game. So I'm probably also going two or three points Q. And I'm just gonna try to farm because I don't think I can do much more than that. He's playing pretty aggro, he has attacks with rune. I could have maybe started E and punish him. But he has bone plating, it would absorb a lot of damage in the trade. that rice pushing like crazy not respecting uh jungle gank if my chain lands rice dies i miss cannon very good gank step into the right direction sad that i miss cannon though went two points q just to try to crash the wave in I'm gonna go hover bot. We know Kha'Zix is probably bot side, so I need to ward right here and potentially support my team. So that Kha'Zix is bot based on the way Jinx is working. Okay. So I haven't based yet, which means I probably am looking to base TP at 800 gold with Dorns and can amplify it home. I should let mid lane wave bounce and then we can look to regank him. He has no flash. Right here, if he wants to EQ me, I'll gladly take it. Like that. I'm just trying to make him push the wave a bit more. Alistair's here to protect him though, but we don't know where Kha'Zix is. I also need to Q him to get bone plating off him. We should go on Rice, he's flashless. I can easily flash over the minions and make sure I get him with my E. Very good. Now I think I'll push the next wave. I have enough mana to do it. And then I'll reset. Okay, come to base. 
Two points Q, now we're gonna stop Max and Q. This guy went no health item, no boots. Wow. Very, very, very cocky buy. I'm going full damage. I can I'm close to one-shotting him at this point. I want one shot him in a combo, but I can do like 70-80% of health if I land literally everything. However, I have to also be careful of ganks right now, like Kha'Zix hasn't been active at all yet. And he probably did bot the top clear, sorry top to bot, which means he should be top side now. Or maybe I'm... Maybe I'm wrong, I don't know. Wave is not in a safe position to take all ins, really. I don't need to get his bomb plating off again. I steal his ult here for another auto. Okay, that was a bug. I don't know if you guys noticed that. But I stole his ult and I didn't get a passive auto take off for some reason. I can ult, but we need Lona to move there. We need to finish, Rice has level 6. Rice is on his way, I'm out. Wait, what? Rice is not on his way. I definitely lied. I'm basing, I'm 1 HP. What is going on? Okay. Very interesting outcome. It's good that we stopped Jake. It's good that we got Jake because now we can probably get Gr Jake and Grub. So it's like really good, obviously. I think enemy Alistar is... Okay. Flash, Kha'Zix. Rise Flash should be up now. Mine is still on cooldown. Can I say no? I think he cancelled my W. I watch you sporadically for a few months lately and I used to watch you heavily during Kha the Korean solo queue era. Careful. I was wondering why you had such a hard time to hit Challenger in EU West. Then I just saw it's your fourth Challenger grind. I'm I don't dumb lol. I don't have a hard time hitting Challenger. I don't want to be in Challenger. I'm playing I played in Master Tier the whole season for better YouTube content and faster queue times and shim. That's why. I wasn't trying to be challenger. <clears throat> so Rice has flash. This is a good timer to trade. This is gonna be a listen. I trolled. I didn't dodge a single Q. No. Okay. Ah, uh, what am I doing? Not worked. I had to dodge one Q or try to dodge one Q of his. Don't you try? Don't you climb to challenger when you're not trying? I do, but then I decay my account after. I got challenger multiple times and I immediately decayed my accounts back to master. It's kind of bad, like I have one death and I kind of lost all my lead already against him. You can see I'm one level down because of how much roaming and how much skirmishing I've done. I wanna E? I do have Avengers though, that's kind of nice. On my way. Damn. 
What a game so far. A lot of fighting. I still can't beat Rise 1v1. I should have eaten and then killed, I think. Nice. The, jung the jungle camp mid is real. I'm pretty sure I should have done the combo differently. I kind of want one plate, but can I? A plate and a wave, because that's gonna give me enough for Leech Bane. Okay. Five darks is text. Now I'm back. Now I'm back. I am back. I'll TP up if my bot gets ganked, I'll be there. How does it feel to have a jungler in your lane? It feels good. It feels very nice. Rice might be ulting button. We wanna fight the dragon, I assume. They work their fingers to the bone, serving a king they'll never meet. And we'll show them there is more to life. That's really annoying. Kha'Zix is just one-shotting me. I can TP. I don't mind giving a mid-wave and just TPing back into the action. I'll do TP on mid-wave though. Or mid-tower. I think. Back. Flushed. An enemy has been slain. Do not touch the enemy. The problem is, I don't really have enough damage to kill them. This is kind of annoying. And I'm, I have Max W, but I can't ever use it. Or Max Q second? No, it was Max Q first. I feel like we killed Rice so many times and the game still feels really hard, no? Am I the only one? That's why I kinda don't like playing this matchup and I wanna avoid it as much as I can. Salas Rice matchup. Not a good matchup. I'm playing a tower, but he's in trouble now. Now we get Mega.
Alistair's probably close mid lane. Okay. I can kinda all in him if I know where enemy jungle support are. I got I think two towers here. Not afraid of anything. I can just stank tower with my ult if I have to. Lana. Nana has ult, ult. She has no flash. Boom. Go, go, go. Boom. Oh, Jax died. Crap. Listen. I don't think that's worth if you die and give a shot down. to run that minion was very very annoying there because he blocked the chain the couldn't get the angle I'm not missing the cannon lots not today okay base again so what I go Zonia since I have money for Cosmic, I think I just finish it. I didn't care for it. I think I'll just finish it, yeah. I'm running mid as soon as I can. Oi. I guess it's okay. Bit of a weird fight if you ask me. I don't know. I don't have Alistar nor ult, so maybe I should have stolen Kha'Zix ult. I can, but if Kha'Zix comes, it's his. Yeah, pretty close. That was... That was literally half a second for him to take it. Or maybe even less. I need to start farming for Zonia. The Jinx has two items, I don't know. I feel like we can lose this game pretty easily. Need to team quite smart or we'll lose. I also really need levels, I need to be higher level. A shepherd with no 
Sadas doesn't scale that well anymore. So when the game goes too late, we can be in big trouble. Are they doing it? I'm in time. I'm for sure in time. I need to steal Alistair World so I can team fight for long. I think this Baron call looks very in by them. I don't know why nobody stops Alistair World. I mean, this was... This shouldn't have happened, like what? How did we manage to only kill... One person? That is really bad, like someone should CC the... The rise. But they can't just get out of the pit like that. Like we have no damage. Kaisa items are weird because she's build a bearing. Jack's randomly died. This is this is gonna be a tough game. No doubt. This is gonna be a very tough game. On my way. That's probably a good bait. Joke. It's actually another good bait. They have double TP or whatever. Jing Shraps. Jing Shraps, I'm so sad. Oh, Lona died so fast. I thought she'd be a bit tankier. I think we lose, yeah. Her comp, I guess, she scales a bit better. And I don't know, her team doesn't feel to be that chunk. Nice, that was a good play. Maybe we can get Infernal of that. I talked about it a bit, Mephisto, a bit. I'm not TP. That was smart though. Looks like we want to make a bot play. Maybe a hover bot sudden. Ah, there's a war. Very unfortunate. What can they do to me that they have not done? Next fight, I think I'll have to probably get Alistair ult again. Rise is very tanky. 
But he's not even the biggest problem. Everyone else is a bigger problem than him. I'm so close. What can I do though? My team just loses really hard. Tipping, fuck it, we need to make something happen, I don't care. Just that. Got you now, Jinx! Pick up all the Inferno Cinders. I mean, small comeback. I think I just secured us Baron with this TP. If we get to Inferno Soul, I think we can win. Kaisa build is super weird. I've never seen Kaisa with such a weird build. Holy moly, Starak, man. That item. We need to get Baron here. We need it. We got two kills. Like, we need Baron. I went on him. Finish it. Okay, he dodged it. And now recall. I'm gonna run. Okay, that was a pretty good comeback. So I push one more top wave and then I get ready to be a dragon. Dragon is soul point for us, we kinda need it. Let's get some Inferno Cinders. We, we still have time. Oh, I'm so close to Rabadon. I should definitely buy Rabadon. One minion. It's gonna be faster if I kill one minion than if I base. No, you fucker. Let me base. I think I'm in time. I should be in time, I should be in time. So Rabadon is way better here, because I already have Seekers, so it's Minizonia. This is for sure better. We need to win this fight, I guess like, which ult can I steal? I can steal other start sims. Oh fuck. I have quite a bit of CDR to fight. Inferno Soul. I'm running! <laughs> Give me my red buff! Fuck, I think it's time to do the blue now too. Alright!
We should fight, no? Why don't we fight? Kill them all! I got Alistair. Holy, what a comeback. We need a wave. The cannon need a wave. Is that cannon? Oh wait, we lost Baron. We have time, we have time. There we go, I got him. Holy! Okay, those were... Good place, consecutive good place, you know? That was nice. It, I had a lot of haste in late game because Inferno Cinders and stuff. And obviously having cheap in Inferno kind of won us the game. I think our comp... Our comp was... I think not scaling too well, but because we had triple Inferno and Assault, it became pretty good scaling comp. That was a pretty pop-off Salas game, but early to mid game was a bit slow. 46k damage.